Covering Camden County this week, county commissioners voted to move forward with the controversial spaceport project, despite voters overwhelmingly rejecting it last month. Well, the project's been in development for years, but a recent referendum vote essentially blocked the county from buying the land to build a launch pad. News 4 Jacks reporter Joe McLean was in Camden County today where the fight over the spaceport is taking off. We were here almost six weeks ago when voters went to the polls and three fourths of them voted against the land sale to build the spaceport project. Well, now the county is saying that that citizen referendum should have never happened. And they're moving forward with the sale anyway. After a judge validated a 3500 signature petition by Camden County registered voters, the question got on the ballot. Should the commissioner's authority to buy the 4000 acre plot of land for the spaceport site be revoked? 72% of voters said yes, effectively blocking the sale. But county leaders went to court over the referendum, saying the process should have never applied here. And on Monday, voted to move ahead with the land sale anyway. The county issued a statement saying, in part, the board determined that moving forward in this fashion was in the best interest of the county in order to protect the launch site operator license that was recently issued and the millions of dollars the county has invested so far in the spaceport. In the written statement, the commission also attacked the legitimacy of the ballots, saying the March 8th referendum was not even an accurate assessment of the majority of the electorate's view on the issue. Later adding, the board is therefore confident its position will ultimately be vindicated by the Supreme Court, which is now considering the case. James Goodman is a city councilman in St. Mary's and was one of the plaintiffs in the lawsuit against the land sale. The county continues to thwart the will of the people. It was clear to everyone who voted what they were voting for. The county now says that it was a mistake on the part of most of the voters. Ridiculous. What do you want to see happen next? We're going to have to appeal. We're going to have to see what the court rules. Supporters of the project say the spaceport will bring economic benefit from both launches and related industries and tourists, but opponents fear the environmental impacts and operational hazards of a commercial launch pad, but also say the economic benefits are being overblown. The county's lawsuit against that citizen referendum, that's currently pending before the Georgia Supreme Court. It's scheduled to be heard this summer. In Woodbine, Joe McLean, Channel 4, The Local Station. Last week, Camden County leaders and citizens also heard a pitch from a private investment firm that was exploring its involvement in funding the project. Meanwhile, the company that owns the land now, Union Carbide, says it's reviewing its options in light of the county's ongoing litigation.